think we are recording. All right, so we got some packages from Amazon. I'm not sure which is which, um, but it looks like this might be the Champion's Path. This might be the Vivid Voltage by the silhouette of the color. This is a little bit red, this is a little darker. So maybe Champion's Path is voltage, something like that. So how's everybody doing? We are Thornton Collectibles. Um, I do a lot of artwork, so um, I put gloves on my hands just in case I've moved stuff around. Um, as you can see, we have a lot of art stuff here at uh, and no, this is not a gun. This is a torch for resin. <laughs> we do a lot of resin stuff. We sell a lot of resin products. Um, but for this video, I'm going to be opening up some Champion's Path and uh, Vivid Voltage I got from Best Buy. I'm sorry, not Best Buy, Amazon. <laughs> so, um... Let's get it going. Let me uh, just open this. Let's just do this. Ah, I was right. Champion's Path. What do you guys think about this packaging? I always get nervous buying stuff from, from Amazon. I'm hoping that it doesn't have to have that those that print on it with the Pokeball, right? I'm not sure. Um, guys are the professionals we just started this channel um, so with that said welcome um, and please uh, hit that subscribe button like I said we're just we just started we're a small channel um, we're here to help and um, if you have any questions um, about art I would love to answer them I'm more of the art side um, as you can see the Pikachu here the skateboard deck um, I just started collecting the cards. My son Austin and my nephew Stefano are uh, more likely to help you out with questions about uh, the Pokemon aspect of this. Um, our channel isn't going to be specifically for Pokemon stuff, um, but there will be quite a bit. Um, either opening packs, um, selling packs, giving packs away, um, and a lot of artwork. Uh, my brother Steve also does uh, some artwork uh, as far as he makes little boxes to put cards in, to put D&D &D dice into, um, and he puts those boxes together, makes them, they're really awesome. Um, we will have some of those on the channel pretty soon. Um, so if you're interested in stuff like that, leave us a comment, let us know what you want to, what you'd like to see. Um, especially for these 18 inch Pikachus. Um, I have three that I'm going to be painting. Um, they'll have half faces, they'll have full faces, they'll be pop arty. Um, my fiance is going to stone one in Swarovski crystals. If somebody's interested in one like that, that would be, that's gonna be amazing. Um, but uh, let's get into these boxes here. I wanted to save them, but why? 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 Why save them? Let's open them up. Let's enjoy them together. Um, and even if there's not anything in here, it's the excitement, right? It's fun. It's it's the it's the fun of the hunt, if you must. 
We need a slogan for this channel. Fun of the hunt. I don't think that's a good one. <laughs> so we'll start with the vivid voltage. That's where I found my first uh, Charizard. It got me hooked. My son got me hooked around Christmas time. Let's see here. Oh, I think that's the, uh, the amazing, no. That is one of the amazing rares in there, right? I need, I have, I have four of the amazing rares. I need two more. I think they both start with a Z. <laughs> yeah, I'll be doing a lot of artwork, y'all. Like I said, the skateboard decks are gonna be something awesome. opened up one of these before. Um, I've opened up two of these before. What do you guys do with this stuff? Do you guys keep them? Oh, I have a hole in it. I hope that doesn't... Ooh, I'm going to be upset if somebody had been messing with this. I love keeping all these. Card, your energy stuff. I save these all for Austin. Alright, let's get into opening up these cards. Yeah, there was a little hole in that one. That one's loose. Goosey goosey. I live on a very busy street. So, this is what I want to see. Ooh, you know what I should do? Is weigh these. Should we weigh them? We'll do that to Champion's Path because i got to go over and get the weigher. Um, we have a scale. Uh, we do a lot of shipping through our resin company that we have. Um, right, right in that next room over there. <laughs> Let's see. Right there, that's all resin stuff. So if you guys need your countertops done or um, some artwork for the wall, let us know for that too. <laughs> so I like to look at all of the, let's move this camera a little closer too. Um, everything about the packs, like if they've been tampered with, because like I said, this is from Amazon. I, I honestly don't know, know know what to look for other than, you know, stuff like right here being messed with or that you could tell it's been peeled off and put back on. Um, and all this looks good. Like all these packs, like obviously I haven't looked at all of them, but they all, everything is, looks pretty uh, legit. Right. Oh, there's. Is it? Was this a pick up now? We're gonna open those two last. All right, let's get into this. Ooh, I don't want to uh, make sure that stays in frame. I feel like there needs to be a little more light in here. Let me let me open up this curtain here. We have. So much light in here. Oh, that looks a lot better. I have to put curtains up in there because our, our walls are basically windows in this building. Here, I'll just show you. So we don't get those. I want to always make sure to keep the cards in uh, in a uh, shot of all the cameras. <laughs> I don't want you guys thinking we're switching stuff out or whatever you, whatever people do. But look at all the windows. Like we have nothing but windows in this place. All right, so 
let's open up some packs, man. And I have this camera in front of me, so I gotta get used to that. And if you guys would like to see a different camera angle or um, maybe not me, <laughs> let me know. I can put these cameras however, however uh, you guys uh, would like. Um, do I need to be closer? Like I said, we are new at this, so and I don't know all the names and I'm a horrible reader, so just like to do this. That looks fun. Alright. Let's open up these so we can put those in here. I should just get some penny sleeves. I don't want to get up though. <laughs> I'm being lazy. I'll, uh, I'll put these in, in different in different sleeves later. Put these off to the side here. Put them on here so they don't get messed up. Uh, what do you guys What do you guys do with your wrappers? Just throw them out, keep them. Do you try to open them to where they're they're nice? I uh, I opened some McDonald's ones today. Um, and I learned that you can open them from the top just enough and put like a, you can keep it super nice because it's paper. It's not like when you, when you pull this, it doesn't rip. It just kind of opens up. And if you take like a coffee stir and you can run it along the inside, you can take those cards out and have a nice, perfect, very nice uh, package. If you want to keep them like that. Well, look at that. That was a nice one. What do you guys think of that? Do you think... Is it that easy to open these all the time? What do you think? I always... <laughs> I always... Uh, uh oh, white code card. That's always fun. And uh, there's times when I just go straight to number six. I think we'll do that on these uh, Pikachu ones. Does that matter? Does the does the wrapper matter? One, two, three, four. Do I see something? Do I see a little? I think I see a little something. Maybe not. I'm getting my hopes up. <laughs> Also, y'all, I would love to know what your favorite uh, Pokemon would be um, that you would like to see on a... I really like this. I like this this little guy. And I like the guy with the... I, I'm new to this, so forgive me. I don't, I don't know all the names. Um, but he has a skull. I believe my nephew said it was his mother's skull he wears on his face. The little dinosaur-looking guy. Nothing. Nothing too fancy. Oh, that's nice. All right. Um, I would love to do that on on a skateboard deck. I think that would look nice. I think I'm gonna put these in separate separate ones here. If I need to go faster, let me know. 
I want to I want to keep you guys happy. I want to keep you entertained, but also I don't want to bore you or you know, I'm trying not to repeat myself with questions or whatnot. But um, this is this is just a lot of fun for me. There. Oh yeah, let me know what uh, what you'd like to see on a skateboard deck or a piece of artwork. What what do you guys what do you guys see in? What's your favorite? If you've always wanted to see, you know, something done on uh, a canvas, um, we have, like I said, we have a, a resin company, and we have so much glitter, and um, I would love to do a layer of nothing but like how uh, the halos look just do a whole layer of that on a, on a canvas and then paint something over the top of that so it looks like a, a halo is that what it's called halo <laughs> me and my uh, terminology here um, so it looks like a card I mean I'm not, I don't think I want to put all the lettering and whatnot but it'll be you know the the, uh, I like that little guy too. The Pokemon image, the character. There he is again. I'm going to keep this one out so I know to look him up. Ooh, nice. Is this a regular? That's a nice pull, right? <laughs> Non hollow. Hold on, let's. Uh, I want to get. I want to get a top loader for that. I'm gonna get these two. All right. So. That's a nice pull. That centering looks nice, right? That's a nice one there. Very nice. I'm glad. It's so funny. Um, I've opened up quite a few packs, and we just started this channel, and and uh, I got a, uh, and I do have it on film. I do have it on. It's in one of our videos on here. Um, but it's a hollow, and I'm pretty sure I cussed <laughs> in the video. So, um, you guys go check that out. I'm pretty sure it was from a. Are they called X, Y, X, Evolution, X, Y? Let's just, I'm gonna take a bunch of these out of here. And you guys noticed that came with a green card. So not always do you uh, do you have to get a a white code card, right? I always wondered about that. But it's always exciting when you do get a white code. Everybody gets a, their little hopes up. So, um, oh my God, that's so funny. This is uh, this is my fiance's favorite card <laughs> um, because she calls her dog Moo Moo. And it's funny because his name's Cujo, and he's a little palm, and there's nothing Cujo about him. 
uh, but she calls it Moo, so she loves this card. <laughs> so we're going to put this aside so she can put it in her collection. <laughs> I think um, we're going to be doing, I think we're at like 25 subscribers now, which is pretty awesome in my book. Um, maybe we'll do a giveaway if we get to 50, so if you guys could please share this. Um, I promise we'll have a lot more content. <laughs> um, I just got back from vacation, um, snowboarding, and I proposed. So, um, I will be doing a lot more videos, a lot more artwork um, this coming month. Um, I believe I have something on, uh, on here with the, with the Pikachu. Um, actually, that one is sold. So, if you're interested in something like that, I can make you one. Not a problem at all. <clears throat> so, let's just get into this here. Um, and I was wondering about, I keep hearing, not keep hearing, but I've heard about um, a pack called a God Pack. I guess that's all cards amazing. Has anybody ever gotten one? Has anybody ever seen one? Knew somebody that got one? Let me know in the comments. I'd love to know. Look how fun that one is. Thing. Does not look like it. I like that. I want to keep that one out too. That's nice. I like the look of it. It looks very paintable. straight for it. How about that? Pa ching Nope. I still like to look at him. Somebody posted uh, the other day about um, what is your favorite non follow card or chase no chase card right that's what it's called um, popular you know as in char pikachu all those uh, very popular ones um, if you if you have one that's just something you'd like to see it's, i guess it would be kind of like this one like i like how this looks it's super fun it would be fun to paint Make that look like that's glowing inside of there. All right, here we go. Let's see what these have to offer. Everybody loves a Pikachu. <laughs> oh, that was turned around. Weren't all the other ones like this? Hmm. Is that strange? Is it strange, y'all? Let me know. Two. 
One, two, three, four. to be in on a session of them naming and drawing these things. Uh-oh. We got something here, y'all. A little something. Got a something. What is that, a full art? Is that what that is? I'm not sure. <laughs> well, we'll put that in a sleeve and a top loader. That looks like a fun card. I know what I need over here. I need my, uh, I need my magnifying glass. <laughs> so I can see the, oh, there we go. I always look at the numbers. I don't, I, I'm not, you know, familiar with what people look for, what's valuable, but uh, I'm always interested in seeing the numbers because apparently they make uh, cards that are higher. Does that, does that make sense? Higher? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Like a 197 and they only made 180, something like that, you know. Rares, I guess that would be called. Oh, here we go, that's nice. One, two, three, four. Wash energy. Oh, look at that. I like to keep that to the side. Keep all those, because you just, you just never know. Somebody might want them. Am I going too fast? Am I going too slow? Let me know. Oh my God, I got it. This is the one I needed. <laughs> Did I not say that? That I need amazing rare? And there's something behind this too. Look at that. Oh, Mergersh. I'm going to put this down. Right? No, I need this one. This is the one I just looked at. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I was trying to put it down so I could put it in the sleeve and make a... Do it as a surprise, but it's a V. That's so awesome. I was... This is one of the ones that I needed for the set of the Amazing Rares. It's funny, I was just talking about it. See, now what if I wasn't recording this? Nobody would believe me. Record it, y'all. Set your camera up. This is, we go live on my other channel practically every day, so we have this set up like this, so um, we have all these cameras. You can use your phone. It's that easy, just to record, just so people will uh, can't give can't give them nobody can give you crap about you know where you pulled it, when you pulled it, what it came out of, blah blah blah. All right, let's put that right there so we can open up this champion's path. I think these are decent. I think that's good. That's so rad. I'm so happy. And tell me this. Uh, my son Austin said that he has a, I want to say a Charizard um, that he pulled that, the, that the, the centering was so off that that makes it even more rare. Um, so it doesn't go down in grading. I'm not sure. Is that a thing? Is that true? I'd love to know. Let me know. All right, let's open up this bad boy here. <clears throat> I 
we're gonna have to give uh, whoever sent me that a good review right give that person a good review so people can go buy from them and what do you guys do with all this stuff you keep it throw it out what do you do I mean I think you should probably keep them right like you never know what could uh, people could want stuff like that right and these boxes I love these boxes like these are great these are great to keep stuff in I keep all my cards in there all right I'm just putting all this stuff out of the way here let's put these away whoops sorry about that And what do you guys do with all your extra cards? The, the non, uh, what you call them? <laughs> what you call them? What you call it? Oh, I forget you get these. I always keep this. I have uh, two of these, three of these. I have one in the case. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave these, leave them in there. Have a look at these cards. See what uh, if anything looks fishy. And I hate it because you know you read you read all the, uh, the comments, negative comments. Oh, they've been resealed. Obviously, I didn't get anything and. You know, I would love to see videos. That's why, like, leave it in the box until you start recording. You leave it in the container it comes in and record, just so that you have proof that you opened it from the beginning. <laughs> um, it would. It doesn't hurt. All right, let's start this up. Keep going. Let's go. As Corey and Godzilla says, let's go, my guy. And I think all champions paths have, uh, have the white coat card. One, two, You guys want to watch a great uh, live stream he uh, he streams him playing the games he streams him drumming and he does a lot of uh, rip and ships he he does one Wednesday and Sunday night his name's uh, Godzilla gaming um, so go check him out he's got a great uh, Facebook stream. Facebook, I don't know if he has YouTube yet. Um, I know he has a TikTok, and I think it's Godzilla Gaming. Um, he's got an amazing horror collection. Horror, like horror movies. That he got kind of, uh, he went viral. One of his videos went viral because of his collection. He has uh, handmade uh, horror stuff like Jason Mass, Chucky, uh, Michael Myers, stuff like that. Goodzilla Gaming. Cool guy. Uh, he's a bar owner here in Dallas, Texas. He owns a bar called Crowdus. Um, Start Select, I believe. It's like a video bar game. And then he owns a hair place um, it's like a speakeasy in back what is this anyways like is it is that a, like a spray bottle uh oh we got something got something 
another one of those. Everybody has at least five of these, right? <laughs> That's all right. If anybody wants these, I'll give them to you. All right, let's get to this next pack here. Let's go right to five and six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And everybody has about 20 of these, right? <laughs> Both of these actually. So what I think I'm gonna do, I've seen people do this on TikTok. Uh, they, uh, they paint on these cards. They don't paint over these. They paint here um, and they make it into different fun situations, I guess you could say. Um, and I thought about doing that with some fun ones that are in different positions. Like this guy, I love this one too. Hattering. Um But put them to where they look like they're at a skate park. Everybody's got a skateboard doing tricks, hanging out at the half pipe or the bowl or whatever. Um, I think that would be pretty amazing and just put them all together I'm gonna keep that one aside because I like how that little guy looks. And uh, yeah, do it like a skate skate uh, skate scene. I think that'd be fun. One, two, three, four. Those, those, don't you get tired of seeing all the same thing because you're hunting? That's a nice, I have one of these, I, yeah, I have a blue one. Ooh, it looks like I got some under there. Uh -huh, I think I have one of those. So what do you guys think so far of this pack? What, 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 what's on your mind here? What's on your mind, and do you think that people weigh these? Like, I, I hear about it, but is it easy to, to weigh? Uh, do they mess with the boxes? They could. You never know. I don't know. I, I, I hate to think about it, but there are people out there that do that, and I don't, I don't get it. I didn't even think about that until I heard about it in Pokemon World where somebody was talking about weighing them and I was like, that's pretty smart, but it just doesn't, that's bad juju for you, you know? People are trusting you to send your money, send their hard earned monies, and you don't send them packs that could have some amazing stuff in it. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? All right, let's get some fire here. That's what Corey says. Let's pull some fire. <laughs> and there's a, the one guy, he's like super hyped. I can't think of his name. He's a super hyped guy. I follow a couple different guys on. Facebook and YouTube oh yeah and also the female trainers I would like to do uh, skateboard decks I just did a Marnie sold that one um, but do kind of a real version of the female trainers for uh, the females you know <laughs> those what do you guys do with all your duplicates you just keep them put them aside give them to the kids you got to give them to the kids if the kids want them you're not going to do anything with them all right The 
if you guys are interested in any of these cards, and you want one, let me know. Or a couple, just so that we can make it worth shipping. You pay for shipping, I'll send them to you for free. Oh, this one. All right, getting down to the last three packs, y'all. Let's get some some last three pack fire going. Is there is there a saying, certain saying for stuff like that, or is it just last pack magic? That's fun. No, and no, these are killing me. Look at that, same guy, same guy. <laughs> Looks like the elite trainer, Champion's Path, doesn't have much. Let me get this straightened up here. Let's get something, guys. You gotta keep your spirits up. And like I said, if you don't pull stuff, it's fun. This is all fun. This is, this is, Good stuff. Taking your mind off something bad, negative, or what, whatever's going on in your life. Oh, you know what? Did I not do the three? I can't remember. Nope, I guess I didn't. There you go. Or I did. Oh, yeah, I did. I just... And let me know if I pass something that I should be putting in a, a sleeve. I don't know. Uh, some cards are good. Some cards are not. All right. Here we go. We got. Uh, this is what we're going to do. We got this little sound machine here. So if we get something good, we'll do this. If we get something good, that's just for the opening the pack. <laughs> and if and if we don't get anything, this is what we'll do. Give it some good juju. Come closer. Ready? We're going to do the drum roll. <laughs> well there you go that looks fun I'm going to look this one up too is this shark with a star on his head that's pretty awesome I'm going to keep that one aside throw this one in the bunch and there you have it looks like the uh, vivid voltage pack whooped up on we were doing a card battle pack battle I think the voltage whooped them up I'm keeping these to the side because I like this little Charmander and then the other ones I want to look up to see if we can do some artwork with them and Erica's Moo Moo Cheese <laughs> Do you guys have a significant other, a wife, a husband, boyfriend, girlfriend, uh, relative, 
that uh, that has cards that you're just like, that's worth nothing. And they're like, I don't care, I love it. I think it's fun. Something to uh, look after there. All right. Well, that was fun. Exciting. You guys got to follow along and see what I see. And speak of the devil. <laughs> The old fiance. It's funny. We call each other B. It's a long, long joke when we first met. B, as in boy, as in, um, as in bicycle. Um, and she called me fiance, but then said Beyonce. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to make her a shirt that says that. Beyonce. I like Beyonce the singer, I like fiance, but with a B. Austin, all these go to you, bud. <laughs> all right, that was fun. I got one car. That's so worth it. That's so people people buy um, cars so they can you know to to get a what do you call it to to, to get a set, and there's nothing wrong with that. You buy all you want. You pay for what you want you want to pay for a a, a a fat boy Pikachu you pay for it I would love to find it I, that's the whole that's the whole reason I do this it's so much fun um, and that's so rad that I got this I'm super happy with this um, I have some Japanese cards coming I have some uh, Sword and Shield coming from Best Buy. Got to pick those up tomorrow. And uh, I will definitely put all those on tape if you guys on tape. I just really like age myself right there. Um, and I'll even tell you how old I am. I am 50 years old. <laughs> My son is 27. Got me into this during Christmas. And I can't thank him enough. I love it. It's fun. It's entertaining. And... Uh, I never, I never was into it, you know, back in the day. He was when he was little, but didn't keep anything. I should have kept it, but uh, um, I did not. I don't think his mother did as well. <laughs> now he's regretting not keeping his stuff. But it's fun. It's, it's, a, it's a blast. Um, so, yeah. Stay young. Have fun. Collect stuff. Buy your set if you want to. Find your set if you want to. But whatever you do, don't go crazy doing it. <laughs> you guys have been awesome. We are Thornton Collectibles. We'll see you guys later. Bye.